welcome to A1R Psychic Radio and Moonstruck TV. Uh, this is Understanding Spirit. I'm your host, Mary. Uh, while I'm waiting to see if any callers come in, uh, coming through today, I'm going to continue with our conversation uh, last week uh, with auras. Um, the uh, the aura is a very complex energy system and it does connect with the physical body and our spiritual uh, existence as well. Um, we, uh, it's very important to control your, your aura because we have to learn to protect ourselves with it and also um, to control the energy uh, around it with uh, whatever's going on at the at the time sometimes you sense somebody coming very close to you and you might not be happy with um, the energy that's coming through uh, from that person um, so uh, that's what's happening on the outside you know the whole body is an energy field uh, an energy system so and then also internally uh, we have, um, you know, the energy that is running through our body, flowing through our body continuously. Um, there are ways to uh, sort of, you know, um, learn about your aura uh, as well. There's an exercise that you can do if you're trying to develop. Um, uh, you know, you can just um, uh, get a person to uh, sit on a chair and uh, just sense their aura around um, around them um, just with your hands. Okay. Now, I feel like we've got a caller coming through. I think it's Suzette. Suzette, are you there? Hi. Hi, I how am. are you? Uh, where are you? How are you? I'm from Barry, Ontario. Oh, beautiful. Thank you. You are my first caller on this show. I'm a little bit nervous. Um, so I'm going to try and muddle through and hopefully uh, I can give you everything that you need today. How can I help you today, Suzette? I was wondering if you see any career opportunities opening up for me. Okay. All right. So you're just after a psychic reading today? Pardon? You're after a psychic reading today about your life? Oh, yes. A psychic reading for me, yes. Okay, thank you. I'll just have a look. Hi. I feel, Suzette, that you've got, you've actually got a lot of um, opportunities, right? Uh, I feel like if you just um, kind of take a moment to just sort of um, uh, look at your opportunities, you'll realize that you have a lot more uh, than you than you think. Does that make sense to you? No, because I, I haven't applied for anything and I was just trying to figure out which direction to go in. Yeah, that's okay. If you just, I think that you, um, it doesn't matter if you haven't applied for anything just yet. If you have a look at your options, um, uh, you'll see that you have a lot of options for you. I also see that you may need to do a little bit of studying. I see it being more like online or a short course of something to get your foot in the door. Oh, okay. Does that make sense? Yeah, I, well, I was Are looking you, to become a Pilates instructor. Sorry, a body what? A Pilates instructor. Okay, all right. So um, have you studied for that yet? No, there's an opportunity to study for it in September. Okay, beautiful. All right. So I I feel like that is a good uh, direction um, for you to go in. 
I do feel that you are also um, quite interested uh, in the in the body. I feel like you could also um, like be off from Pilates as well and be an instructor for other things too, anything regarding um, the body. So you're going to have more um, uh, choices. All right. Are you interested in bodybuilding or teaching and instructing that at all? I am. Yeah, because I can see you being successful in that area too. Oh, okay. All right. So I was looking um, at holistic nutrition as well. Yeah, my guide's giving you three tick, three ticks for that. I'm also seeing like um, juices and that uh, with you, like especially a, a green one, anything that has like kale, you know, spinach, all those um, uh, kind of uh, things. And I, and I feel like that's something that you would recommend um, for people uh, as well. Are you juicing already for yourself? Sometimes, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Just like playing around like with my own start, stuff. Yeah. Because I feel like you'll start to try a few different ones and then you'll be recommending them um, also to uh, any clients uh, that you have. But I do see that uh, oh, anything okay. that goes the natural sort of uh, way um, uh, is uh, good for you. I am also being told by my guide that down the track, not straight away, but down the track, um, as you sort of like get your foot in the door and that I also see potentially, um, uh, this is something that you can produce yourself, your own line of um, like juices and that. But I don't see like a big selection. I, do, I see like maybe like five, six kind of uh, different kinds of, flavors but this is in the future it's not right now I just feel like at the moment you've got to um, do your studying and uh, kind of get your foot in the door and start I'm also getting um, like yoga uh, for you as well are you interested in um, teaching yoga because I see like a, the whole spiritual side coming I in um, as well and a lot of breathing um, techniques I am actually, I was looking at that as well. And I wanted to yeah. do it with kids. Beautiful. Yeah, that's, uh, that's actually uh, really good for children to, yeah, to learn um, how to center uh, themselves. Um, you, uh, I feel, my guide's showing me when she was saying that you have a lot of choices, this is what she was talking about. So like the Pilates where you're wanting to start the yoga, uh, bodybuilding, excuse me, bodybuilding, um, all those kind of things, the nutrition, right? I just see like once you start, the floodgates just kind of really open up for you uh, regarding all this stuff. Oh. It's just getting the start, oh. right? Just starting off. Oh, perfect. Okay. Um, it's just getting yourself in the right place around the right uh, people. She's telling me just make connections uh, constantly. Um, I feel like you have a very bubbly personality and um, that people are drawn to you uh, naturally because of it. So I feel like it would be very um, easy to kind of uh, network around this. Does that make sense? You resonate with that? Yeah, I'm, I'm like that. Yeah, I'll, I'll talk to everybody. Yeah, beautiful. You're lovely. You're my kind of person. <laughs> I talk to everyone. Oh, too. thank you. <laughs> um, and, you know, that's what we need more of, you know, in, in the world. Um, and uh, so I just see that yeah. that is... Yeah, go on, Suzette. Do you see reading a book? So... Reading a book. 
Oh, no, reading a book, a kid's book. Oh, for you, yes. I, I can see you doing that, 100%. All right, and I, um, okay, my guide's giving you, I don't have too much time, but my guide's giving you some direction with this. And remember, Spirit can just give you suggestions. Um, you don't have to do what Spirit says. You do have free will. Um, but uh, I see that the, the book is a spiritual book. It's uh, kind of camouflaged in a, in a kid's story, but you're teaching spirituality and exercise um, and how to open up and uh, connect um, for kids to learn how to do it and just to open up and go from three-dimensional kind of thinking into four-dimensional um, uh, thinking and appreciation of uh, spirit in their early um, years. But my guide is saying, make sure that you incorporate um, protecting with the white light, um, uh, placing the ribbon of white light around them, and also putting them, placing themselves in a bubble of uh, white light. But she's giving me a three thumbs up uh, for that. So definitely work on it. And I feel like spirit is gonna guide you along the way with all of this as well. I hope that's helped you today, Suzette. It has, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Uh, you're very, very welcome. Uh, good luck with everything. All right, and I wish you all the best with your career. Oh, thank you. I really appreciate oh, this. You're very, very welcome. Take care. You too. All right, bye. All right, um, uh, well, I <laughs> wish you all of luck. Everything that I was seeing was so great for her. Uh, enjoy your day. Bye.